okay now start the hands on work of this so we go to the azure devops microsoft azure uh, click on the start free and before you going to the azure devops you must first uh, open your account for the azure portal then if you are adding your uh, credit card then you will get a 200 dollar free for one month practice that is enough for learning purpose after that you will uh, you will charge for uh, using different type of component and parts but azure devops is free so in uh, so i'm going to the free account i'm already logged in my using my username that is the reason i go comes to the my organization it's the organization name and it's all the project i have already completed there so when you are with the open the azure devops in first time they told you to uh, create your organization then you create your organization or i i am showing you so continue switch different okay continue so that time this type of skin you will show so i create an organization suppose my organization name is uh, udemy udemy azure devops is my organization you can host any type of country so i am now living in bangladesh so that's uh, my uh, so closest part is the south india so I added the captcha VGG 6KP. I think that is the correct. The organization already given DevOps PRC PREC W N B 5 N H H. Okay continue so it taking little time yeah so when you are creating your new project you will get this type of skin so First of all, it left side it will show all type of organ uh, all type of organization. I have already created two organization. You can edit multiple organization from here. So we need to create a project uh, in this organization. Okay. So I am set up a project that is uh, Udemy DevOps training DevOps training. That's my project. It's a private repo so i create a project by default it will add the git is the version control and so if you project setting you can show it will show some information about the type of project it is mm. so it's the process there's the basic process uh, what is the process process means what type of uh, architecture you follow the setup your sprint planning uh, or management so you can search about the azure board azure board type so you can it will show you several type of board in azure azure board type if you search azure board type azure board Azure board configure and customize Azure board. This link not deleted. Yeah. So there is a four type of board already present there: Agile, Basic, Scrum, and CMEI. Basically, Agile and Scrum two are same. Uh, Scrum is the uh, framework for the Agile. Okay. So we use the Scrum project, Scrum uh, process. That is one different. If you see, is a backlog is a user story and tax, and here is the differences. Uh, backlog uh, the user story change to product backlog item. Okay, so now uh, again go to our project setup. We change our project. So I change the click the basic. Uh, okay, 
basically it's set up in organization so i am showing you how how to change it i go to my organization and project and you see only one project is present there so i can check the click the process part it show you the board process and all process if i click all process that is the click on the process link you will get the information of all type of project that is basic agile scrum cm cmmi all type of project is present there so we can change any type of project in different environment so if i click to the project and if i go to the project uh, process i want to change the process to all process uh, project change process select target process is scrum okay so that time first it warning because if you the middle of any project suppose you are creating you are creating a project in the scrum, uh, agile process and and you are uh, going to the further that time if you change something you have you have lost something okay so it's the best part you, you can change the target process in the beginning of set up your project so i click to the change close now if you all process you show the in scrum only one project is present there you can so now if you are creating another organization so it also default create a basic but you can change this default project so i change scrum is my default project so next time if you are creating any project that also move in the scrum okay so first part we completed we um, we create a project and we also change our project to uh, basic to scrum okay now we need to add a user so without user you are not you are not doing any project so first of all we need to add a user in our organization okay so by default my own account shawn ghosh is my brother account already present there now we added several user in the project so basic level is basic is enough so add to project this project or you can assign uh, project later so i add a user because my email address i already added uh, i am now adding gmail.com so Support 007 and I also added my an another email address dot triple a at the rate gmail.com. Okay, add user. So this user is not present there, and I also and send a in uh, email invitation. So I add the project is Udemy DevOps training. Okay so sorry okay dot, dot, yeah, dot it, gmail dot com. Com. user and another user triple a gmail dot com and my another office email the post dot gosh dot dot com so three user i already added there and also assign the user in my Udemy DevOps project. Click on the add. So now if I refresh this, so you see my some user account is showing there. So, <clears throat> and this user need to be, uh, they, they also get the email. So I go to my email address dot com azure devops you have been invited in the project of azure devops okay so 
I click the join now. Join now. Uh, copy link and using my Gmail because in my Gmail I already logged in. Sometimes you are getting this type of information. Oh no, you do not have access. But after within some minute, uh, then you can uh, go to the this link properly. Okay. So if I go to again and again click the copy link, copy link, and go to the Gmail. Again hit the point so this type of within uh, one or two minutes uh, so sign out login different account suppose i am logged in close all browser window so if i click azure devops start free Now I am uh, forgot. I am using tapos dot double a the gmail dot com password. Yes. So if I try the link again, okay. So when you if you are facing this type of scenario again and again. So, best practices remove the uh, recent invite. I send recent invite the user and again log into the Gmail account. Date so join now. Okay, and check. Sorry, this uh, I sent recent invite. Now recent invitation sent. If I go update, I'm um, refresh. Refresh this. Okay. So again, I the re, uh, recent mail is coming there. If I click join now, I'm getting some time. I think my internet connectivity has some issue. Again, I am facing same type of. So I am showing you again and again because I am facing this type of issue several times, and you also facing this type of issue again and again. So now I am creating another way remove from organization. I am now re removing the user from the organization. Again, add this user. <coughs> double A at the rate gmail.com okay 007 basic at sign to project okay project contributor my role again sent now again again i go to the invitation link in a second another invitation will become Okay, another invitation coming there. If I click join again, so show happened. Azure DevOps project home. I wait a couple of second. Okay, so now again recheck. So now join now. Oh, for a long time later, the join is completed. Okay, so I'm using two browser for Edge for my the main account, and 
organization account who is the creator of the organization that is the Shaun Ghosh is the organization creator and I am the Tapush Ghosh the main uh, another user and in this portal you also get information which time they last access this, this portal so this video i am not getting this video too long so this video what we done we create organ uh, we set up we create organization we also it's a organization url so your uh, when you are creating a, a, any organization that in your url is dev.azure.com slash the organization name and we also create our uh, first uh, project in the or, uh, in the organization and also in the project we already added user and also change the project uh, basic setup that is now our project is not the process is not basic now we change our project structure to basic to convert scrum okay bye